right there. Please be whole. Uh oh. All right, I haven't been out for about a week. We've got Marcy with us. Casey's calling me over, says he's got the first coin of the day. I'm getting tired of this guy. Hold on, here he is. All right, what do you got? Looks like a weedy. Probably. Well, you can't even tell you planted that. <laughs> I see Abe. Yeah, I do too. Uh, yeah, that's a weedy. Definitely. Huh. Yeah. All right, it's still a dollar. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's a nice find. Marcy just come over. She's looking all over the ground for arrowheads and other stuff, and she just brought this over. I think that was like a Pond's or a face cream or a... Nagzima. Oh! Or Nagzima. Hope I didn't break it. Oh, that was close. <laughs> Here you go. Having a great morning, but... Casey's ruining it. <laughs> I think he says he found another coin. We'll see. What do you got? Pretty green. Ooh, that looks like an Indian. Looks green, yeah. That's gonna be an Indian. Oh yeah. Let's see here. 1896, I think. Very nice. It's a green one. One wiper. Very cool. Casey might be digging all the coins, but I think I got something really cool. That rang up like a 99. It was close to the surface, but I'm digging them anyway. Uh, it says McKean County Motor Club, AAA. I'll take that home and clean it up, straighten it out, and show you guys later. Casey says he has a pretty good signal. I think I'm going to jinx him for the day. Let's do a live dig. Nope. Yeah. <laughs> I like awesome. All right. I think I'm on the board. I just popped it. Looks hold. Haven't picked it up yet. You see it? Oh, yeah. oh it's light. Oh. I think it's going to be a Bazinga. Piece or something? I don't know. Uh -huh. I think it's aluminium. It's going to be a token of some kind. Alright, I'm back. I don't know who would take the time to, to put a hole in that thing, but definitely a heartbreaker this morning. Just a Cracker Jack coin. Don't get me wrong, I'm still happy with it, but man, I thought it was silver. Oh well, on to the next. Casey's calling me over. Yeah, you guessed it. Another coin. All right, let's see what he's got. It's bent a little bit. Yeah, it looks like it got hit by a plow. Yeah. Looks like it could be a button. I think it's a Lincoln. <laughs> oh, yeah, there he is. It's all right. It was green like an Indian. Yeah, it's, it's huge. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I think I just dug number five for the year. Uh, here let's have a look all right right there there's a big one please be whole oh <laughs> oh oh <laughs> that's, that's my biggest one wow holy cow that's nice too wow Very cool. <laughs> there, let me clean this baby up. Finally on the board with a coin. Uh, it's probably gonna be an Indian. Here, have a look. Right there. Oh no. Uh -oh. Ah, I see. A Hey. The weed I planted. Oh well. I believe I just pulled a suspender clip. Uh, here, have a look. We'll clean it up. Is 
certainly did. Let me clean it up. There it is, all cleaned up. It's got a patent date on, on it, uh, 1871. There we go again. You know the drill. Yep, Casey again. What do you got? No, it's not a no. large tent. Size. I'm thinking of Canadian cool large scent, maybe. Yeah, Canadian large. I found one of these before. Yeah. That's neat looking. Yeah. Uh, 1918 Canadian, yeah. Oh, okay, let me see. Or that. Canada, yeah. Cool. It's, like it's really down. light. Yeah. The search continues. Yeah. <laughs> I haven't found a U.S. large scent, but... And a Canadian. Very cool. We'll yeah. clean it up and take a picture of it. Casey's calling me over. Yep. Same thing. Kind of hoping it's a Lincoln. We'll see. It says it's not silver. Probably wasting my time walking all the way up here. It's a Lincoln. <laughs> it's like a green Lincoln. I ain't gonna stop. I don't, I don't even want to see the back. <laughs> We've been here a couple hours now, working it pretty hard, but finding a lot of stuff. There's Casey in the background. Hey, what do you got? Junk. Oh, he's got junk. Uh, but I got something good. I think it may be my first silver thimble here have a look here it is let me clean it up i think i'm gonna still be on the quest for my silver thimble guessing it's aluminum casey and i are at another place right now we left that uh, old farm site i've been digging quarters uh, 65 quarters. I got a couple, three of those. Uh, got uh, a hole full of uh, wheat grains and stuff like that. So I just thought this was another quarter, and uh, I popped it over and have a look. Kind of surprised. Here we go. I started rubbing on it. I, I was like, ah, I didn't know what the hell that was. Sorry for the language, but uh, I believe that's going to be a wow. Largy. Oh, that's a one wiper on the back. It looks nice there. Let me uh, get a toothbrush on it or a toothpick and see what it looks like. I'll be back. Here it is, all cleaned up. Got a pretty good date off from it. You guys can see that. Uh, very happy with that. I just thought it was another quarter. Uh, I set my toothpick down, and I am not able to find it to scrape the back off, but she's in really good shape. You can see full liberty on her. Very happy with that penny. <laughs> All right, we'll be back. Uh, I just did it again. The other one was right over there. I'll show you here in a second, but, but I just popped another one. Here, have a look. Wait, there's Casey behind me. He's coming up with one too. Let's look at his first. All right, here's Casey's. That's his first one, but it's a. Yeah, we'll count it as his first one. It's not all there. <laughs> Unfortunately, there's not going to be a date because somebody put a hole through it. But still an awesome find. We've been here about an hour, hour and a half. Yeah. Cool. Congrats, man. Yeah. Thanks. Okay, here's I'll mine. I put the put the dirt back over top of it. I haven't looked at it yet. Hopefully it's like the other one. I can see something on it. Yeah. Ooh, it feels pretty smooth. Here, let me uh, clean it up. We'll get back, back to you. It's kind of smooth. And we're back. This one's pretty it's smooth. Not going to be able to get a date on her. We found two. There's got to be more. This is the stuff we're working in. It's high grass. It tangles up your coil and you just find a bare spot and try to get your coil down in the grass and wiggle it around. Anyway, we'll be back. The other one was right, right there, a couple feet away. Finally did it. Finally got silver for the day. Haven't looked at it yet, but here, have a look. Well, 
Washington. That's all right. Happy with that. 1942. Heck yeah. Very nice. All right, we're done for the day. We finally have enough to do a nice wrap up. We've had a good day. We'll start with Casey's finds. Some wheat grains, a small buckle, 1918, one cent. Canadian. Some kind of bottle top. We're not sure what that is. Oh, you can put that in there too. Felt RC. <laughs> not sure what that is. Then an Indian, 1896 Indian. And he found some kind of, uh, this is probably a hardware off a, off a desk or a chest of drawers. Okay, my finds for the day, uh, this license plate or something that will go on an automobile. It's pretty heavy, pretty stout. McKean County, AAA, Motor Club. I believe that's a three ringer. Uh, we don't have any Civil War activity up here, but probably the same caliber. Uh, seven Wheaties, some clad, the 65 quarters, heartbreakers. Uh, the token, I'm not sure why somebody would do that to us and hold that. Man, that looked like a whole silver. Uh, a couple thimbles, white marble. That is a uh, counter sport in Port Allegheny Railroad. Uh, bell seal. Uh, 42 Washington. A couple largies. Unsure of the date on that one. That one you can see 1830. And the find of the day. This little monster. Pretty happy with that. It's the biggest one I've found. Number five for the year. Anyway, thanks for watching. <laughs>